Hello traders, welcome to Allies Blue. This is Deepen Gogoi. In this video, I will discuss about uh, Bank Nifty and its uh, pivot point support and resistance market trend or market range. And we will discuss about the anti point in the uh, like in Bank Nifty. For which direction with, uh, it will better for enter. It, uh, it is buy, buy, buying direction or selling direction we will discuss. And I will discuss also uh, SL and target. So before we uh, like uh, start this video for the pivot point, uh, users visit to our website alliesblue.com uh, slash pivot point or when you will go to our website, you just click in tools and you'll see there is the option uh, pivot point and go through this uh, pivot point and here you will find the pivot point bank nifty or other shares and stocks uh, support and resistance and pivot point. So here you can see in the weekly, uh, your weekly, this is the weekly chart. So I just try to draw here that weekly is, is just near the previous resistance line. Here you can see this one, the previous resistance line. So uh, last uh, few week, uh, they are not able to break this level, but uh, they're forming a dozy pattern here. So market is unidentifying here right now. So that means in which direction they will go or either buy or, or sell in direction. So it is not confirming here because it is a, you can see weekly big uh, strong resistance here and it is a support. So in this zone market is running. So I hope uh, if they are not able to break this level, so it will come down, but uh, still they are not uh, confirming. And uh, if we see here, like just a minute so we see uh, if you see in the daily chart so let's see here so daily chart they are forming higher high from uh, after reaching the lower point and uh, around 28 december uh, near to 28 30 december uh, 28 29 december i think uh, they are uh, after creating lower low they're creating higher high right after reaching the lower point, they're creating higher high and higher low. So you can see they're creating higher high, higher low, higher high, higher low, higher high, higher low, and the higher high. So in the daily chart, have you seen this one? I place a 20 moving average. They're, they're forming a support here, right? Here support, now support. So I hope uh, from this area, they're forming a support. So from that area, again, they'll try to go up in this week uh this week right uh this is daily chart and uh, therefore uh, sub, uh it will be a resistance near here uh, near this uh, i draw that line by connecting the previous higher point and they're running in a zone uh like uh, you can see here this is a zone they are running in this zone so i hope market will stay in between this zone only right so let's see in a small time frame like um four hour let me remove this one so four hour uh four hour also it is uh running like that same higher high and moving hours and one thing you can uh observe here uh like 50 moving hours you can see uh, this one 50 moving hours 50 moving hours crossed one uh 150 moving hours in this upper direction here have you seen this one right so when it is cross 50 moving average to 150 moving average in a daily chart you can see uh, that means we can uh, like confirm that market is going uptrend that means market uh, already taken that means uptrend right so if we see in a small like um four hour chart it is fully uh, they are clearly showing that is uh, uptrend right and here let me check it to one hour so one hour, they are just uh, they have given some retracement uh, last uh, two to three days, I think two days. They are given some retracement from this area. So I hope it will go up again from that area, right? So uh, what where is uh, where is your target? Like uh, if I draw a diagonal line, so diagonal line we connected two higher point, right? Uh, here one next to one and uh, we got that like resistance line so i hope it will go up to this area right 
So now you can see the percentages are also confirming that to, uh, pointing toward uh, minus 50 level. So once they break this minus 50 level and at that time I think uh, price will close above that moving average 20 moving average. So it will uh, it will be a sign of a bullish trend right and uh, let's check it in 15 minutes in my trading system okay let me remove it and this is my trading system have you seen this one this is my trading system and my setup right i'm using the hacken uh, sorry uh, ishimoko uh, kizusen line 60 and ishimoko 2 uh, 2 ishimoko uh, i'm using here ishimoko 1 and this is 60 line and another 26 so according to my trading strategy so if the this price is close above this yellow line have you seen this one this is the period of 60 so let me show you have you seen this is the kizusen line the 60 if they cross this one close above this one suppose let me show you this is a yellow line have you seen this yellow line and the 60 ishimoku line right if they close above this 60 ishimoku line the price so i'll go for buy right I'll go for buy and my, tar my target will be the here uh, near to 27,500, right? Uh, it is almost 200 point above. In Bank Nifty, this, uh, it is not a big deal at 200 point, right? So, I'll buy a call order here, above here, and my target will be uh, 27,500. And my SL will be just below have you seen this one uh, 26 um, kizusen line uh, this is little more orange not exactly orange pink color right this is the pink color just below the 20 uh, 26 kizusen line and my target will be and my ratio will be 1 is to 1 right my ratio my tech profit ratio will be 1 is to 1 if now you can see the price is not uh, still breaking here have you seen uh, let me a uh, little more zoom in so here you can see price is just running below this um, 60 kizusen line just close this uh, um, candle so i will wait for another 15 minutes this is the 15 minute chart for uh, that means in uh, like uh, intraday or whatever swing, swing trading i always uh, find out the entry point 15 minutes in a day i am getting one or two entry point in this market like in a day so i am not entering again and again so if i am getting a good profit or hoping that the market will come down so in this uh, day only i just close the position and come out from the market right so here you can see one confirmation we uh, one confirm here that market will go up but still we will not enter in this market because this price is not close uh, above this uh, kizusen line right if price is close above the kizusen line i'll enter but if sometime what happen the market suddenly goes up <coughs> right so they are not giving us any opportunity to enter this market so in that case i'll do that you can see previously the price has gone up up to this area have you seen right the price has gone up up to this area so i i will enter if market is goes up above the previous high so today you can see it is previous high if price goes up previous high just one or two point above i will trigger a buy entry right i will enter here and my book profit will be here and my sl will be just below the previous this one kizusen 60 line okay so if you enter here in this area and your sl will be just below this kizusen line right so i hope you enjoyed this video if you like this video please like and subscribe thanks for watching